Good morning. Well, that tree is actually still here at this home here on Golden Avenue in Lemon Grove. It is a massive tree and it fell shortly before midnight and neighbors having to walk in the dog up and down the street, taking pictures, stopping to just admire just how large it is and how fortunate it is that nobody was hurt in this incident. So I want you to take a look at some of this video that we have right here. So David Gallagher lives in this home and he said shortly before midnight he was watching TV pretty standard night when he heard this loud boom sound that he thought might have been an explosion. Of course, it turned out to be this large tree that fell from his neighbor's property next door. That home belongs to Jamie Roos, and it started off when they saw this happen. They came outside. They called the fire department and Heartland Fire showed up, but according to Roos, they helped all they could, but they said that since this was on private property, there was only so much they can do. As you can imagine, not many tree removal companies are open around midnight on a Wednesday or Tuesday, so they are going to have to deal with that a little bit later today, but they said that they've made contact with insurance companies and they're working all of those details out. But the tree, although it didn't kill anybody or hurt anybody, it did certainly cause a lot of property damage that we want to talk about. So it damaged Gallagher's car, garage, kitchen, front door, balcony, the restroom in his kitchen, and then the electricity is out, so he can't use his fridge or that TV, so he can't finish that show that he was in the middle of. So this is what Roos had to say about this crazy ordeal. Thank God he's okay, but he can't get in and out of his house from the front here, and, and his car's under there also, so, you know, we don't know, uh, yeah, we don't know what's going to happen or how long it's going to take, but hopefully it'll be sooner rather than later. Now, David said it sounded kind of like a big boom explosion. And then Jamie over here next door, he said it sounded more like a crackling sound followed by a big bang, but still something that woke quite a few people up in the neighborhood. And he also told us that he was about to get this tree trimmed and taken care of when this happened. But once those inspectors come out to the property and he can get it taken care of, he just wants to get the whole tree removed, just be done with it and not have to worry about any possibility of it falling over. But he said that this has been here since he moved into that house about 30 years ago. So big takeaway today. No one hurt. Ned and Eric.